but don't run if you're not being chased. Often you see people moving way too quickly, trying to hide things, I, and if you're if someone doesn't know to look unless you look suspicious, then it's like you're running and no one's chasing you. So if I'm going to do a, a coin trick and I'm going to do something like this, then the, I'm making myself look suspicious because I'm moving this hand suspiciously. But if I'm just natural about it, there's no reason for someone to look at this hand because I'm just, I'm just being natural. So don't run if you're not being chased. So you can actually slow down, take your time. With enough practice, it's not going to matter. What you do is convincing enough and you work that into your misdirection as well. And remember what I showed you with a crayon can work with pretty much any object, that visual retention. If I do it once, they see it already, their brain tells them that that's what happens. So when it looks the same way again, their brain tells them it's there, and by the time it's gone or somewhere else, you're already one step ahead. You're already, um, you're already gotten rid of it before they can backtrack and figure out what it is they're supposed to be following.